All right, so we're on to page 36. So these exercises you've encountered before, page ooh, 30 and 32. So, um, and 34 for our um, tonalization. So now we're tonalizing G major, okay? So like we did with the D string, we're going to do this with the G. So we're gonna play two long Gs, two long Ds, and then a doubly long um, strings together, okay? So here we go, G, G, D, D, happy medium, together. Okay, so that repeats. Let me change my angles so you can see my bow angles. Ready, and. Happy medium. So go over that a number of times until you actually catch the two strings together, okay? You can't let yourself get away with doing it half the time. This exercise is meant to teach you how to catch both strings at the same time. Next is uh, G, G, and then the three on the D string, uh, like mentioned in another video before. The third finger on the D will make the G string resonate. Okay, here we go. Okay, so in this case, you might be able to see how the G will buzz, well, not buzz, but it'll vibrate. It just stopped ringing. So you should be able to get, um, well, on the smaller violins, maybe two to three seconds of ringing. On bigger violins, the resonance um, will last a lot longer. So let's try that again. So. Together. All right. So hopefully you can see the G the G strings vibration there for um, with the resonance. Okay, and next we go on to the G major scale. So there is your tester teaser for the next video, which will be the G major scale because we're going um, into two different octaves. All right, happy practicing.